Waves flooding and skyrocketing food costs. New climate change research out of San Diego details alarming predictions. You see San Diego researchers behind the data tell 10 News reporter Amanda Brandeis they're calling on politicians and community leaders to act now for the sake of future generations. Scientists are sounding the alarm. Climate change is in our living room and it's here to stay at least for the next 20 to 30 years. Viran Ramanathan is with the Scripps Institution of Oceanography. He and other scientists report our warming world will bring more extreme events. Neither poor or wealthy societies will be immune from the fallout. In California, he says fires are here to stay. If my own predictions come true, I'm hoping they won't. In 10 years, everything we experience could intensified by 50 percent. By 2050, they predict as much as 44 percent of the planet could be exposed to drying, leading to severe drought affecting 1.4 billion people. By the end of the century, scientists say populated regions could face heat waves of 130 degrees. We need to think about what we are doing to our children by destroying the environment. Heat and drought also impacts our food supply. Researchers believe prices will rise 23 percent by 2030. Despite the dismal predictions, Ramanathan says there is good news. We can still do something about it. He argues it'll require deep cuts in emissions and removing carbon dioxide in the atmosphere. But still, not everyone is convinced of climate change or that it's driven by humans. Ramanathan says this. It's not a Republican issue. It's not a Democrat issue. It is an issue of science and data. And that it'll take the work of humans to chart a new course for the planet. Amanda Brandeis, 10 News. Researchers called on faith leaders, healthcare providers, and community leaders to work together and be part of the strategy to combat climate change.